Hello there, Master Haddish here, and welcome back to my Minecraft Series 2 Let's Play, where we are doing transportation across the view across across the Viewer Plus Minecraft server. And we're here in the workshop in the industrial district, and this is my to-do list. And on the to-do list, we've got things like doing portals and maps and things and horses and um, we've got we've got farms up here that we might do, but they're not directly related to transport. They're more resources for then doing transport. Um, we've got our uh, lovely little uh, workshop done, which we've got an end chest in now, which is nice. Uh, and we've got the bits at the back done in the warehouse, and we've also got uh, the rail network done, which we did last time. So this time I would like to work on some air travel. Now we recently went to the end and defeated the Ender Dragon. We did it at the beginning of the last live stream that we did. Um, so not last time when we did the maps, but the time before when we did the live stream. And we got the Dragon Egg, which is fantastic. Now the other day, me, DJ Egg and Elaine went to go and try and get an Elytra and find an end city. We did that. Okay. Now, we all died. <laughs> but we have one. We now have an Elytra. And I've put a Mending enchantment on it. So, in theory, we can keep going forever as long as we keep getting some XP. Of course, if you've got an Elytra, you need rockets. So, between this temporary sugarcane farm which I have put in the middle of the industrial district. This this square here, that this is actually going to be our storage area, building, barn, factory thing. Um, but between the uh, the mob farm and this temporary sugarcane, I have been able to make myself a large quantity of rockets. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the elytra that... We got in the end. And I say we got in the end. I, all three of us went in. Uh, I died. And then it was pretty much the end of my lunch break. So I couldn't go back. And then uh, Elaine and Egg died. But they went back and got the Elytra and their equipment back. So we know where the end city is. Let's go find another one. And bring back another elytra. That's the plan. And maybe we'll find more. So, yeah, let, let's go do that. Now, the first thing I'm going to do is travel to uh, Elaine's logging base because that's the closest base to the end portal. Now, I think I have all the supplies I need. I've got a shield, that's the important bit. Uh, I could do with some ender pearls, and that's noisy. Why minecarts come under friendly creatures, I have no idea. Also, the rail network's working brilliantly. And why they're also so much louder than everything else. Although that portal was quite loud. Okay, so now we're here. We're at Elaine's base. There's the arrow where the map is. There's Elaine's uh, main tower. There's a tower. Um, so what we need to do is... It's actually just over here um, where the portal is. So we can use the uh, these to travel somewhere properly. And there we go. Now... Whilst I didn't acquire uh, the Elytra, um, Elaine yielded it, and Egg has also let me have it as well. The premise, the whole idea, is that I will get them their Elytras as a thank you for helping me get mine. Uh, also, like Elaine's new to Minecraft so hasn't got a massive experience of, of flying with these. There's always a risk that something's going to go wrong. And I could lose it, which we don't want to happen. Uh, I just realised I needed an ender pearl, but it's alright. 
I've got one in my ender chest and there is one last ender chest over here so I don't have to worry about killing endermen to do it. I want to save the durability on my sword for something better. Now do I need silk touch? No, there's the dragon egg. Let's take a couple of ender pearls. You know what I haven't brought with me? I haven't brought any blocks. That's unlike me to travel without blocks but never mind no 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 not in the ender chest we don't want to put them we are bringing all the rockets with us so we've got some arrows which we shouldn't really need um, we've got our shield which we will need and we've got both an ender pearl and some um you know what we will just take all the ender pearls there we go we can try and use them to save ourselves if anything bad happens we just need to keep an eye on the durability of the elytra because it hasn't gotten breaking on it yet and we really probably could do with that. So this is the gateway that we spawned with the dragon. And I'm not going to sell these two elytras. Because we, we went as a team elytra hunting. And I think it's only fair that the two of us come back with one. I say the two of us. I meant the three of us. I think it's only fair that the three, has come, three of us come back with one. Um, but if I get more than that, then I think it would be fair to sell them. Now, for viewer purposes, um, this is the the map that we have here. So you can see we're on the edge of the void. The void is to our west, and the islands are out to the north, south, and the uh, east. You see, we travelled east across these islands. You can see the little bridges that we made to get across. And then we got to here, and we split off into two teams. One carried on going east, and one went north. And you can see the bridges going north here, and then here, and then the end city was there. Okay, so that's where we're going to head. We're going to head to that end city, and then from that direction, we're going to either continue heading north or continue heading east, because the end cities tend to be on a grid, and we want to find a new end city. So, let's do that. Let's go. So we have to make sure... Oh, hang on. I want some chorus fruit before I go. Because if anything goes horribly wrong, I can eat a chorus fruit and it'll teleport me down to the ground. Incidentally, that's what kind of went wrong when I went to... Um, there we go. We've got a good map. Uh, when we went to go and get it in the first place, we managed to find... Um, Elaine found the city. Me and Egg um, joined up with her. And then um, I... What did I do? I pillared up to the boat to get the elytra. Um, but while I was up there, a shulker hit me. I floated upwards and I was like, ah, if I fall down, I might die. Because we're only wearing unenchanted iron armor. It's, we're not well protected at the minute. We need to get the uh, XP farm in. Uh, and then we'll get good gear. But I ate a chorus fruit so I wouldn't die. Which worked, but it teleported me back down to the ground. And then in the onshoeing kerfuffle that happened, I died. Right, so there's the first bridge. Let's, uh, how many have I got? 16. Okay, let's put ender pearls on my hot bar as well. And a second stack of rockets. Let's do this. So... We're flying through the end. We're going to just keep an eye on this durability, that's all. So I'm going to try and go as direct as possible. So I know that we're going to be turning left soon. What we like on durability. We've lost, near, I would say, about a quarter of durability already. We haven't even got to the, uh, the original end city. <clears throat> oh, here we go, we're at it now. So we need to be careful when we land. We need to make sure we don't look at or anger a load of endermen. I'm going to use one more rocket. There is water absolutely everywhere around here. <laughs> oh my goodness. This end city is such a mess. Okay, durability is not great. But we managed to get here. That's the important thing. There's an ender chest here, which I didn't know. That definitely doesn't need to be here. So we'll take my silk touch pick out of the ender chest and take the ender chest with us. Now, as far as I know... This end city has been raided. And also, this is probably most of my gear from before. We'll take the end stone. Uh, I don't think we need any of this. 
we'll, we'll take the cobblestone blocks as well in case we need blocks we'll probably don't there's just a load of iron gear which is not important to us um, because we've got an iron farm so th this is you know, these there's even hunks of iron just sat around here we won't take a bed or the chest or anything we'll just we'll just leave this stuff here yeah that's fine that's fine okay uh like i said assuming that there isn't uh anything here to explore inside this end city uh we need to head either north is it north which way are we going uh oh no east e yeah north that way or east um i can't i can't bear to leave those two blocks there right so we've explored what we need to do we've got here now we need to find a new place i'm going to replenish the durability of the elytra before i go anywhere else so this is why i wanted the blocks we're going to go two blocks up one block there like this and we're going to go just a little bit wider and then we're going to come back in here and anger a few endermen and try and repair it so there we go let's anger you Now the only thing I have to worry about is my sword isn't, um, that's loud, isn't it? My sword isn't mending or anything like that, so I got some XP, that should be a little bit more mended. Let's go over here and see if we had any spare sword, because it would be nice to take one with us. That one's there, but it's low on durability. I guess I could combine them when it gets low. There's another one. There we go, that'll do. I've got my bucket of water, okay. Let's do that a couple more times. Uh, get a little bit more durability back up. We can stop at any point and do this. As long as we've got blocks. Let's get a group of them. There we go. Oh. Man, he should just get me there. I'm, I'm not as safe here as what I thought I was. Let's get some more blocks down. There we go. Now, now I'm now I'm safe. <laughs> wow. There we go. Just just gonna get some more XP. We're about there on the mending jobs. Is uh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, there's that one. I mean, it's looking a bit better. Ah! There we go. There we go. Oh, that's that's looking a bit better. Also, loads of ender pearls, which are going to be handy. Uh, right. Are there any endermen that are annoyed at us? No. Right. Let's start from this city. Start from this base, and we're going to continue heading west and see how things go now hopefully we find another end city um, if we don't find another end city then it'll be terrible right. we've got our chorus fruit We've got our blocks, our ender pearls, our rockets. We've got so many rockets. So we're just keeping an eye out. Actually, while we're doing this, oh, um, we're not in single player, so I'm just going to land for a second. Let's come choose this area over here. It's quite flat and there's no endermen there. There we go. Um, didn't mean to do that. What I do want to do is just change my field of view temporarily so I can see better around the edge. Um... And we just need to check that we're still heading the right direction. So, yeah, look, that that way's south. So this way's east. We're, we're still heading east. So, whoa, that was a low takeoff. Okay, so there is one of the gates. There is a, um, what do you call it? Uh, it's, it is a, an end gate, I think is the name of those things. So we found an end gate, which we're not really bothered with because 
I suppose if there's an end gate somewhere near where we're heading towards, then that's a good thing. Oh, the durability on the elytra is just absolutely falling. Look at that. You can almost see it going. We just need to make sure that we don't lose durability on the elytra whilst we're flying high over many islands. We can, we can, oh wait, there we go, end city. Has it got a ship? It has not. Okay. So we'll go on the roof. Try not to anger these endermen as we come in. It's a funny noise that they make. I never, never really thought about that. So we have managed to find an end city. Okay. I'll make a note of this end city. I'll kill some more Endermen, and then we'll try and find the next one. And hopefully, it has a ship. Okay, so I just found my second End City. So we went to an original one. We found one that didn't have a ship. I've just found the second one. We can have a look at the map, actually. You can see how far I've flown from the the from the uh, the, the, the the first End City I found to the the. Uh, there we go, you can see better, to the, that one. So we've got the original one over here with all the water around it. That's End City 0. End City 1 didn't have a ship. And here we go, End City 2, and it's got a ship. And I've landed in, and I've just quickly killed, killed the Shulker before it damaged me. And we can pick up the Shulker shell that that dropped. We can take the Elytra. That one can be Egg or Elaine's. And we've got Curse of Vanishing. So we'll take the gold. We haven't got a gold farm yet, and respiration and unbreaking might be useful for now. Oh, some diamonds, that's going to be useful. Another curse of vanish vanishing. Uh, yeah, that, that's not really that useful, is it? So, we'll leave them there. Um, the durability of the elytra is about half. So, I'm going to do the same thing again. I'm going to go down to the... Actually, I could just swap the elytras. And just go back with low durability. I, really, I should put it in the ender chest. Keep it safe. Yep, we're going to put it in the ender chest. But what we're going to do is we're going to put the low durability elytra. No, because if the other durability goes down, then I can't kill Enderman to mend it. So we're going to put that one nice and safe in the ender chest. Okay, so that's one for me, one for Elaine, and one for Egg. Now, well, no, wait. That's two. We need a third one. So I'm going to do the same again. Kill some Endermen. Mend my Elytra. Find another city. Okay, here's the next End City. And I can see it is. it also has a, uh, a ship. So we're going to just fly straight in there. Like literally straight in through the door. Oh my goodness, I hurt myself a little bit. And we're going to get this one. I haven't even got my shield, but we only really want to hit it when it's open. All right, teleport it outside. Oh, never mind. I think it just killed itself. Okay, we'll have to check the floor. Uh, but let's check the loot. Horse armor, always good, because we're going to do a horse ranch. Curse of binding, we don't want that. Respiration on protection. On, uh, that's a half-decent helmet. We've got some iron here, which we don't care about. Beetroot seeds, which we've already got, I think. Uh, gold, uh, not gold, diamonds, which is good. Um, and some unbreaking boots. Again, all iron, we don't... I suppose I could swap those boots for what I'm wearing. It's like... It'd be nice just to have some unbreaking boots. And we've got unbreaking and respiration. And then unbreaking and protection. So there we go, we've got a half-decent helmet now as well. Um, we can put the iron helmet away. And we can also amalgamate these blocks together. There we go. Well, that is the good news now. We now have uh, all the elytras we need. We just need to get out of here. Now, I did see uh, one of those um, end portal gateway things on my way. So if I turn around, I should find one of them quite quickly but before we go anywhere else we need to note the coordinates of this thing Let's have a look instant health um 
so that we can come back here another time and like loot it properly so let's just do that so well i say note the coordinates we, we have this map don't we but i don't want to rely on the map i want to at least use the debug menu that's already in the game rather than something else we've added so let me just see there we go. So the coordinates are behind my face. Brilliant. That's no good. We'll have to use the other screen. 7,130. 7,130 by minus 1,480 something. So there we go. I've made a note of that so we can get back and have a go. Now we're going to get out of here. And to do that, we need to head in, I think, this direction to try and find one of the end, the end gateways. So let's do that. So we're going this way, and we're just looking for an end gateway. I could have sworn I saw one recently. Also, what's our uh, durability like? Our oh, durability is fine. Our durability is fine. I really did think that I found one. I could be flying around for a little while here, so I'll, I'll let you know when we're on our way out. Right, it was only a couple of seconds. I don't know if it's the one that I found on the way to that end city, but there is one here. I'm just trying to keep my eye line above the uh, the horizon to try and avoid angering any endermen. But it is there is one just here. Yeah, we managed to get down without angering endermen. So then we need to just build ourselves a little like this. Help us get up. Let's do that. And that will do. Right, so in theory, end of pearl. And we're back at the platform. Back, we've got, uh, we're wearing one elytra. We've got one in our inventory and we've got one in our ender chest mission success there we go ladies and gentlemen we just need to get back to the overworld and then we can deliver these to the people who i tell you what we'll, we'll do we'll put mending on them first because that'll be a nice gift won't it so let's jump through the portal and do that okay so we're back at base we can dump a load of our equipment uh, I don't know where we're going to store the rockets and things, so let's just have a look. Rockets. I'm going to say probably in tools, maybe? Uh, we've got spare swords, the other silk touch. We've got way too many ender pearls, so let's get rid of some of them. We've got one shulker shell, which I'll just pop there for now. There we go. We've got some diamonds. Um, diamonds. There we go. We can make some of our suit of armor with that get rid of some of the spare armor and bits we've got horse armor to go with the rest of the horse armor i've been collecting we managed to get some gold and some beetroot seeds i don't think we need the beetroot seeds but we've got them and we've got some boots that we don't need as well there we go we'll keep the rest of the stuff on us for now so if you nip in the ender chest there is the other elytra so that is three in total. I'm going to take an item frame so I can go and deliver these to them. And we need the mending books. So we've got one mending book there and the other mending book there. The only thing is, is I haven't got enough levels to apply the mending books to the elytras though. So if we go over here and try and do it, it costs two. So where do we have an XP farm? We don't. We've just been going around killing stuff, I think. There's no XP farm on this server. Because we've been waiting to get to the end to build the end, the, the end XP farm. Um, right, I, I need to just go out and kill stuff, I think. Yeah. Alright, I'll get the XP and then we'll deliver it. Okay, we've got this spawn in here spawn that I knew about. Um, it's already been looted and stuff, but let's turn it into a mini XP farm. So we're going to do that by, first off, blocking it up. Um, I'm not interested in you. Go away. Well, then again, we do actually need the XP, so that's fine, I guess. 
And then uh, we need like a, a killing platform at this height. Yep, there we go. So if I take out these blocks here, we can make a little kill room. Of course, I'll need to nip in and get rid of the torches. There we go. And then just a way in and out. So I guess just a staircase here. Up to the surface. And then maybe if we just neaten this up, we can use it as a mini XP farm if we don't want to go to the end. Mm, yeah. Okay, I'll come back at some point and I'll tidy up this entrance. We'll make a nice little entrance. We'll put it on the map. You come down here. We'll use these blast blocks here to help block off that. Um... There we go. I've got a few more blocks here, actually. Because we don't want anything out of the cave just coming around and getting us. And then we'll nip in here. And I'll just temporarily take out this block. So that I can come in. I mean, really, this room needs to be bigger. Oh my goodness. Oh uh, no, no. Yeah, I got the block in time. Well, you need a door on here actually because the light coming in might actually affect the spawn rates. I'm not sure about that. But we've got three levels, so I'll get one more level and then we'll go and deliver these elytras. Plop. And plop. There we go. Arriving at the mob district or the zoo terrier or oh my goodness it's night time and there's mobs everywhere see eggs put his map up on a wall that we did last uh, episode ah uh the only problem with this is the map is now not orientated to the direction of which it is facing so it might be an idea if we if we just modify that slightly i did think about putting them on little boards like this i like it um the only challenge, like I said, is, is that like we're looking at the board and we're facing this way. And on the map, that is left. Um, really, when you're facing forward, forward on a map should be up. So in theory, the map wants to be like mounted so that you're facing this way. Because that's north. Uh, but never mind, that's, that's, it's still, I still like it. Maybe when I mention that, it'll annoy Egg so much that it's facing the wrong way that he just has to do it. <laughs> okay, so this is um, Egg's little hut where he stores everything he needs. We can take a peek at his blocks. We can see they've got some Acryan Obsidian already. And Egg's got 12 diamonds and some bits and bobs. He's got the DJ Egg's pick of unbreaking inefficiency. But what we'll do is we'll get one of these item frames and we'll pop in an elytra in there for him. And that's to thank Egg for helping me out get the first elytra on the server. Now we're going to leg it. We're going to go all the way to Elaine's base. So we are currently um, southeast of spawn. And we need to travel northwest. There, I think Egg and Elaine's bases are like the most furthest apart we can have. Why is there a spider in here? Go away, spider. Uh, so yes, they're quite far away. We'll, we'll travel across. Actually, we'll keep the. We won't cut it. We won't cut it because you'll see how traveling through the Nether just makes it so much quicker and easier, and especially when you're doing it by minecart because minecart is quicker than running, and also it's it's hands free. You know, you can you can have that cup of tea or. You can have that sandwich while you're going along and uh, and doing stuff. So this is a relatively large tunnel. Don't think that magma cube will try and get on the track. No, it just stands there and watches us. We do need to spawn trip, spawn proof these tunnels, but it's just so nice to have these tunnels here in the first place. A little bit of bonus XP there. I've even got two levels of XP. So what was that noise? That was a weird noise. Anyway, we're here at Elaine's logging camp. Um, I think this might be like the resource district. So, 
we'll see we'll see what happens there and there's a few structures here I think there's uh, a couple of different structures which are temporary I mean you can't get much more temporary than a dirt hut can you um, but this is where the ender chest is in the bed there's also the upgrade center I'm not sure if Elaine knows what that's for but there is your uh, your mending elytra mm. I wonder it how I wonder how long it's going to be until one of us loses their elytra. But there we go. Today's job has been completed. The expedition to find the first end city happened, and since then we have now gone out and we have found the other two, which means I now have my own. However, I would like to enchant it with unbreaking, so we're going to get an XP farm up and running on this server at some point soon. Next time, I don't know what we'll do. We've got rail, we've got air. Maybe we'll have to look at some sort of land travel, start breeding horses ready for our horse ranch or something. But that's going to be all from me for now. Thank you very much for watching. Put all your thoughts, ideas, and questions down in the comment section. Maybe come over to the Discord to get involved with some stuff, including the game giveaways. And I will see you soon. Take care. Thanks for watching, and for now, goodbye.